So we have something special. Uh, I'm going to turn this over to Mary and Wes and let her explain what this is. Praise God. Ooh. <laughs> let's, let's stop just for a moment and invite the Holy Spirit to seal what we were just taught. Yes. To seal it with his breath. Let him breathe on you and receive. Now I'm going to introduce a song. I got the lyrics five years ago this February. But Wes sat down and the Lord worked through his fingers and gave him the music. But as I was thinking about this, I'm going to read it the original poem to you before he sings. But I want to tell you something. There are things that God has given you that you look for and you go, well, a week passed. A month went by. And be careful when he tells you a short timer. Because with me, it took seven years. Okay? And there's something about this. He trusts you to hold it in your heart and to not give up. So whether it is about salvation or a family manner or something else or about what he's promised that he wants to do through you, for the kingdom, he's trusted you with it. The prophecy that I released at Cane Ridge, I, I carried it for 10 years. The poem that was sung to me I carried that for five years in search of the right person with melody. And I'm going to read something from that prophecy to you because this is happening now. Yes, days of glory, glory bubbling up and pouring out on all flesh. I think if you check, you've got some flesh on you. <laughs> I have prepared a people and I have called them together in this company to go forth into the fields and to redig these wells. Have you not been called to this group? But the glory that will come forth will be both the early and the latter rain together. No longer will I measure out giving a foretaste of my glory. He's asking you to ask for the fullness of all the Spirit of God, is he not? Yes. So this is very appropriate. But these are the days when you will see and you will breathe in my glory and the very foundations will be shifted. I am come to set my church in order so my, I might adorn her in the glory garments that only she can wear. And you're only going to be able to wear them if you follow the seven spirits of God and comply. So, <clears throat> February, February 19, 2018, I was sitting down and I was like, you got something? So I sat there and I was waiting on the Lord and I heard these words. You see, I'm more of a scribe when I write the poems because I only scribe what I hear him say. But this time, I was like, it's being sung to me. And I thought that was quite funny because usually I carry a tune in a valise. <laughs> but I knew there were lyrics in here and that it would touch people and draw them into a place of union that the Holy Spirit will usher you into. 
So I'm going to read the, uh, the poem the way it was given. And then Wes is going to let the Holy Spirit work through his fingers to bring it alive in song. So this is what I heard. In that moment when I see your face, an explosion of love brings showers of grace. In that moment when I hear your voice, faith takes flight to make the right choice. In that moment when I feel the touch of your hand, strength is renewed in your image to stand. In that moment when I taste your goodness and truth, the sweetness of love captures every pursuit. In that moment when I smell your holy fragrance, senses overwhelmed by your glorious radiance. In that moment, I am changed. In that moment, my life is rearranged. In that moment, death is swallowed up by life. In that moment, peace overcomes all strife. In that moment, I'm set on fire. <laughs> In that moment, I know the devil's a liar. In that moment, I'm forever set free to walk as your child in absolute liberty. So I give it to Wes, and I know you'll be blessed. Thank you, Mary. Blessed are the pure in heart, for they shall see God.
shall see God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 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 Blessings. Lord, bless these walking lampstands of Yahweh. Lord, bless each family. Watch over them, protect them, provide for them, Lord, especially now. But raise them up, Lord. Mighty warriors for God. Pioneers, forerunners, blazing trails. Bless them now. Bless them with the full manifestation of all seven spirits of God as we submit, surrender, and sacrifice our lives for you, Lord. We give you honor. We give you glory. Mighty, mighty God, you are worthy. In Jesus' name. And the people of God said, Amen. Amen. Thank y'all.